This is my tiny solar energy module or the SEM and it's a very efficient one in size uh, solar power harvesting module. It's a little board with onboard solar cells. It has a lithium ion battery charger and it has two voltage regulated outputs. And the challenge was to harvest enough energy from indoor light to power low power applications. In addition, it must be tiny and easy to integrate into other projects. The design challenges were addressed by selecting the EP's AEM10941 solar harvesting IC and by selecting highly efficient surface mount solderable monocrystalline solar cells. The AEM10941 is ideal for indoor applications because it has an ultra low power startup. It starts at just 380 millivolt and 3 microwatts, which is really nothing. In addition, it does maximum PowerPoint tracking every 5 seconds to get the most energy out of the solar panels. Um, and these solar cells, they are super efficient. Efficiency is 22%. At 400 lux, which is the light level in an in a office, the ch battery charge current is 50 microamps. And at 150 lux, the light level under a table, uh, the charge current is about 12 microamps. So it does charge at indoor light. That current is not enough to power an application, but it char does charge a battery. And when the battery has a useful charge, it enables two voltage regulated outputs, 3.3 uh, volt and 1.8 volt. And from that, it, you can run the application. In addition, the design challenges were addressed by choosing for castellated vias at 0.1 inch pitch. And using this, uh, you can surface mount solder this board really flat onto a PCB. But you can also place mail headers and then stick it into a breadboard. So how much energy is harvested a day? using indoor light and what kind of applications can you power from that. Um, this one, it harvests about half a milliamp hour a day from indoor light, uh, which means you can power an application uh, that has an average current of 23 microamps for 24 hours a day. So that could be a really simple uh, temperature sensor. Uh, with this solar panel it will harvest one milliamp hour a day and you will you can power an application of that uses on average 45 microamps with this one um, it harvests 2.9 milliamp hours a day and you can run an application that has an average current of 120 microamps and the big one it harvests 6.7 milliamp hours a day and you can run an application for 24 hours a day that has an average current of 280 microamps. I want to show you this application of the tiny solar energy module. Uh, I have soldered headers to the castellated vias and then uh, sticked it into a breadboard. Under the tiny solar energy module I've put a um, tiny lithium ion battery and then this uh, application this temperature humidity sensor BLE temperature humidity sensor I connected to the 3.3 volt output of the tiny solar energy module and um, yeah since this circuit on average takes 50 microamps um, it's it's a bit too much for these tiny solar panels uh, to run from indoor light and then um, it's better to select a slightly larger solar panel for the Hackaday 2018 prize, I wanted to take the design a step further and to make sure people get this board in their hands. Uh, I wanted to sell this board to them. But since most applications uh, have a different power demand than these solar cells can provide, I decided to take the solar cells off and design uh, two more boards. Uh, this is the AEM Lion. Uh, it's basically the same board but without the solar cells. It charges uh, a lithium ion battery, battery so that's uh, why the name is AEM Lion. And I have also designed uh, the AEM Suka, which is basically the same board, but the only difference it charges to a pair of supercapacitors, 
which is really cool because um, uh, supercapacitors don't wear out like batteries. The, they are um, environmentally friendly. And as you can see, uh, this is not a functional board. The only functional board at the moment I have, uh, I've put in this awesome application. This is my temperature, humidity, uh, Bluetooth low energy sensor. It is powered from a pair of super capacitors and this big solar panel. Um, it will run forever from indoor light. Uh, and uh, you will never have to replace the battery. I am selling these boards on Tindy for $24.90.